In this video, I wanna give you an update on my website, wheelalong.co.uk, which is an affiliate marketing website that I made live at the end of July. The website's in the wheelbarrow niche. And in fact, I created a full length tutorial on exactly how I put the site together and indeed how I chose that niche. If you've not seen it, I'll put a link up in a card now. Do go check it out. In this video, I'm gonna show you how much content I've added to the site. Also got some good news regarding AdSense and with Amazon. So I'm gonna be giving you some details on that as well. So I think we're about ready to get started. Just one quick thing before we do. If you're new here, why not subscribe? Just click that button below. Make sure you click the bell to be notified. And if you like this video, if you find it useful in any way, please click the like button. It really helps me out. Anyway, let's go. Hello, it's Alex here from WP Eagle. Hope you're all keeping well. So let's start by taking a look at the content that I've added to the site. Let's have a look. So we go, you can see the site's filling out nicely, quite a bit of content on there. It's a mix of product focused articles and informational articles. It's probably about a 80-20 split. Um, the majority of articles that I like to write are around a buyer uh, intent keyword. So someone that's asking a question about a product. Like, you know, the best wheelbarrows for gravel. That's someone who actually wants a wheelbarrow for gravel and they're about to buy one. You just need to point them in the right direction. So I do prefer those kind of articles, but I've also got some informational articles like, you know, why does a wheelbarrow have one wheel? Total number of articles on the site is now sitting at 21. I've been using a mix of writers to get an idea in terms of which ones I prefer, which one's got the kind of right feel for the site. I think I've got a favorite right now. And um, in fact, I'm hoping that my writer might join me on a video at some point. So uh, yeah, you don't wanna miss that. So as I said earlier, make sure you're subscribed. So let's talk about AdSense. Just the other day, I had the email from Google letting me know that I've been approved, yippee. Some of you will remember that I applied for Google AdSense when I set the site up. And then after a week or so, I got rejected, probably because there wasn't enough content on the site. I only had about three articles. So since then, I've added way more. Well, as you know, I've added a total of 21. And I think about two weeks ago, I went back into AdSense and added the site again. And yeah, this time it's been approved. So I guess the takeaway there is if you are initially rejected for Google AdSense, just do a bit more work on your site, add some more content, and then try again, and you should be fine. Last thing I want to share with you is the Amazon sales. I'm pleased to say that the site has generated a few orders. Let's take a look. Yep, there we go. A total of £3.33 in Amazon uh, fees. And if we actually look at the products that are ordered, well, unfortunately, there isn't any wheelbarrows in there. So this, I think, is just one of those random sales, possibly from someone who watches me here on YouTube that went over to the site and then went off to Amazon and purchased something. But hey, you know, a sale's a sale. Um, but yeah, I'm not really gonna count it just yet until we actually sell a wheelbarrow. That brings the end of this video, short and sweet. I just wanted to get you guys up to date with where I was at with the site. Uh, my plan now is to add a few more articles. I wanna get it up to around 40 or so. I'm then gonna do a bit of Quora question answering to build some links. Then I'm just gonna let it sit for a little while because it takes between four and six months for the sites to really start moving, especially when it comes to Google organic search. I think there might be a little sandbox where Google doesn't really um, put your site in the search results until it's established, until it's about four to six months old. So yeah, I'm gonna add the content, wait, and then we'll see what happens. If you've got any questions, I'd love to hear from you. Why not leave me a comment below? I do read all the comments that I get. I'll do my best to try and reply to as many as I possibly can. If you're not yet subscribed, just click on my face. Want to check out the vlog channel, click on my other face. And here are a couple more videos chosen specially for you. Till next time, bye for now.